When you describe that age that you were and going out for pilots and waiting for pilot season and taking mm -hmm. jobs and not having a mentor, I can't help think of, I can't help but think of Louis C.K. in terms of how that relationship mm -hmm. probably changed, probably was that person that said, just look over here, or maybe that was the right environment for you to... 100%. Yeah. You know, I did Lucky Louis, um, and then Louis, uh, he said that he wanted to cast me um, for a huge reason was because I was a mother of three, and I would have stories to tell. And so there was one episode where um, he was talking about the, the, the script, and it was like when uh, his character and my character married in the show, and that he calls <laughs> me a bad word. I don't know what we could say on Sam Jones. Anything. Oh, he calls me a cunt. Yeah. And so they're supposed to spend the weekend together because our daughter is somewhere else. I don't remember why. And he comes home and he brings me roses, and I'm pissed off. And then he, and and he doesn't know why, and then he calls me a cunt, and he throws the roses at the door, and they... Anyway, this happened because we started having this conversation, and I'm like, I hate red roses. I hate red roses. It's such a conventional, like, blah, waste of money. If you're really gonna th be thoughtful, do something else, not roses. And so that was the base of that, right. that one episode. Anyway, um... And we had fun with that and um, and just other things. And so he really was helping me cultivate my voice as a writer. So what was it about that back and forth that made you, that made that a benchmark for you or made you see that, oh, this is a di this is a different than I thought it well, was? Well, it was, it was the conversation, you know? It was uh, extremely valuable to me because um, I wasn't able to have uh, a lot of adult conversations in my life at that time because my kids were so little. Right. And to be at work and discussing the in-depth, like the intricacies of what characters are going through and things was uh, just like a revelation for me. Right. And when he got his deal to make Louis, he said, you're gonna be a writer and producer on my show. And I'm like, I am? And he said, and you're gonna be in it. Too, and you're gonna play yourself. And I was like, no, I'm not. And he said, and your name's Pamela. I'm like, can I have a cool name? <laughs> you don't find your name cool? No. Pamela? No.